Hey guys, welcome back. I'm XX Poison Gamer XX, so that poison, whatever you guys want to call me. And today I'm bringing you episode number one of Let's Build a Game in Batch. Now, if you guys don't know, I'm a very fluent programmer in Batch. Actually, you probably, guys probably wouldn't know that because you haven't been subscribed to my old channel, most likely. But let's see, we're gonna. To get started, whenever you make any new game in Batch, you always want to make a new folder, so just name it whatever you're gonna call your game. So let's call it YouTube. Now what you're going to want to do is, whenever you start this, you're going to want to make a text document, just dot text, and name it the name of your game, so, YouTube game. Alright, so now open it, and now just don't type anything, just click file, save as. Now, bring this little drop arrow down, click all files, delete this last three letters, and type dot bat. And now just X out of that, and you should have a new file that looks just like this. So now if you run that, there will be nothing. It says this app can't run on your PC. But now right click it, click edit, and here it is just. Now you don't have to do anything else. So, I'm gonna... Don't worry about this, this is just telling you what it is. So, so what you're gonna wanna start it off with is at echo off. Now what this does is, basically... Here, I'll show you. Don't write any of this code. Alright, so if you don't have at echo off on, you'll see this. You'll see the string, and then you'll see the command, and you'll see hi. Then you'll see the actual execution of the command, and the same goes for this one. So, let's. Now, if you put, like I said, don't write any of this code, I'm just showing you what it does. Now, if you put at echo off, run it, you'll just see hi, and then you can close out of it. So, you always want to start with at echo off. Echo is just basically what it means to, or that just basically means showing the command in the command prompt. And by the way, this is Windows only, just so you guys know. All right, so now what you always want to do is put a little colon here and just type in start. Now what a colon means is it means you're starting, if you guys know what Java is or how to program in it at all, the colon basically means that you're creating a new class. So whenever you run start, or actually instead of run, it's actually go to start. It runs whatever is inside the start thing. And you separate these by just making a new one, like start to, or whatever. So what I like to start mine with is actually keep start there, but go down a few lines. Now at the top, type color, color and put like, just mess around with numbers and letters, like AA. I think that's going to be really quick, but here, pause. So that makes it like a grayish color. Or 2A. Just mess around with numbers and A. And it just makes random colors. Or A. That makes it red. Alright, let's make it red. Yeah, and now beneath that type title, and then just put whatever you want it to be. So, YouTube game. Now save that. So now you have it read. And if you look up on top here, the name of the command window will actually be YouTube game or whatever you wrote here. So in your start thing here, you're gonna want to make a few parameters. So first, you're gonna want to. Well, basically, what do you want your? This is gonna be your start menu. So let's actually make the start menu. So what do you want your start menu to say? And every time you want it to go to a new line, you have to write echo. So echo, and you can expand on this as much as you want. Welcome to my game. Alright, so, let's actually delete this pause command here. Alright, so, now if you, actually let's put this back just to show you what this does. So when you press, when you type echo, that basically means that it'll type on the screen whatever you write. Don't worry about the press any key to continue, actually you can do pause greater than no, and it won't be there. But, so that's basically what you're going to 
be your start menu. Now what you want to do is delete pause greater than null and write set slash p. Now write something that you want this to be called. So and you're going to use this for every single one. So set slash p input equals and then down here write if percent input percent equals equals one go to uh, start two and then if input percent and now I'll put neck which means not equal to go to start so now what you want to do is make a new start or start to class and just put pause greater than no And then above here, write CLS Echo Success. All right. So now let me go over what this does. So basically, you have your start menu here. Now, what set slash p input equals means is that all right. So basically, set slash p means that you're setting a variable equal to what the user types in, and that's what set slash p means is that it's a user generated input and then input is just what you want to name it and I like naming every single one of my variables all the same so and it won't mess anything up if you do that so then what it will do is if you clear this up a bit then it will say if the input which is basically this variable here is equal to one then it will go to this second start menu which is just a success and if it's not equal to one it will go back here and actually there's a problem I see already, it has to be start menu. So if you save this, it should work. Now I haven't programmed in like months. So I might mess up a few times. But so you have your start menu, then press one, press enter. Alright, I think I messed something up. Maybe this. I think it might have to have no space there. I think that might be the problem. Yeah, there you go. Alright. So there cannot be any spaces there. So now it'll say success, and then you press any key, and it'll close out of it. So now what you're going to want to do is, I like to make a saving function. So actually, I'm going to teach you guys how to do that. So, echo what account would do you have an account? Echo one yes load echo two no create then set slash p input equals then if percent percent input equals equals one go to load if percent input percent equals equals two go to new and then if percent input percent uh, greater than or equal to or no GTR because then if you type in two it'll bring to GTR go to to go to start to all right and then get rid of that so now we're going to want to do is make a new load class a new class and now what you're going to want to do is now oh god here let me actually get my laptop so that I get the code I forget the code exactly because like I said I haven't programmed in a long time Alright, let me see. I got my laptop right here. How long have I been recording for? I think it's about like 10 minutes, probably. 9 minutes and 40 seconds, yeah. So after we do the load and new, I'm gonna call it an episode. Let's see if we find it. Alright, um. Sorry that my voice sounds a little bit scratchy. I think I might be coming down with something. 
And here we go. Here's my game. Um. Oh yeah, now I remember how to do it. All right, yeah. All right, yeah. All right, so let's first do create a new account. So what you need to do for that is actually up here, it, hit enter twice and put sets. Now what you want to do is just make a few variables. Yes, I know I put slash a. You actually need to put slash a. What this does is it makes a global variable, which is basically where you can use this variable and call it from anywhere in the program. And I'll show you guys that more of that later. So let's just call it 1HP, XP, and level. And then make it equal to zero. Actually, I think that this might be wrong. You gotta have no spaces. I don't wanna have to change it again. But yeah, all right. So now, you're, this is gonna automatically run when you go to it. So what you wanna do is hit enter again and go to start menu. And if you guys are confused on anything, just tell me and I'll go over it again. But yes, now new. What you wanna do is you wanna echo our first here. Echo what account? you like to say it under type your account name alright this is now set slash p input equals and now what you want to do is you want to put open bracket actually did I already do that yeah open brackets echo now put the name of it like the name of what you set up there and you're going to need to do this for every single one that you set and so you'll see me doing this multiple times throughout the series xp echo level alright so now what you want to do is put an equal sign next to each of these and then you want to put percent percent and make it the same thing just percent percent xp percent percent HP this isn't the hard one the hard one is loading I mean it's not hard it's just one line of code but it's really confusing and now you want to put greater than greater than on every one and this will actually be the same thing as if you want to make a save just copy this entire thing and just Just copy this entire thing. But actually, no, don't do that. I'll show you guys how to do that later. But now do percent percent behind all of these. Input input dot bat. Actually, no, you want to put input and then put dot bat after it. So basically, what this is going to do is create a file named whatever you type in here which is input and it's going to write in these variables so let's I'll show you so then what you're going to want to do is just now hit go to start to alright so now if you save this what it'll do is here watch so press 1 to continue no, create. What account do I just save under? So now, type in uh, just what you want to name your account. So I'll type in poison. And if you actually look in your folder here, it'll actually create a new folder. Folder. And if you look in here, it'll have all three of these variables in it. So actually, now what I want to do is I would like to cls here, just so that it clears the screen. All right. So now what we're going to want to do is make the load screen. And I'll explain all this in a minute. So load just echo what is the name of your account. Alright, so now 
set slash p input equals and then this was really confusing I really don't completely grasp the concept of this I just know that it works Alright, so I'll try to explain this as best as I can. Basically what this is doing is... Here, actually, let me... Hold on. I want to do something. Something that makes it look really cool. Alright, hold on. Never mind, don't do that later. But yeah, so now what you want to do is COS echo. I uh, just pick something fancy. Successfully loaded. And now pause greater than no. Go to Or no, or actually we'll make a new one, but go to level one, just say. And now we'll just make something level one, like success or something. And then, what was greater than? No. Alright, so basically, I'll try to explain this as best as I can. What this is saying is basically, for anything... For any for anything inside of the input, which is this, then set everything that's in here to whatever's in there. That's as best as I can explain it, really. And then put CLS. That just will annoy me if I don't. So yeah. So let's save this. Oh yeah. Also, let me explain this. So what this is doing is, oh, I think I actually already explained this. But yeah, if you guys have any questions on how to do something, just tell me and I'll gladly tell, or gladly explain it for you. But do it that. All right, so now, welcome to my game. I hope you enjoy. Press 1 to continue. Do you have an account? No, create. What account would you like to save under? Uh, Poison. Yes, load. Poison. Alright, hold on. I messed something up. <laughs> what did I mess up? Because it didn't successfully load, so... That shows I messed something up. Alright, let's see this. Go to my handy dandy laptop and see what I messed up. I copied it verbatim though. Alright, so actually let's do this first. So, if it's percent input percent dot bat and do this and take this else echo 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 Sorry, we couldn't find your account. Alright, so now what this is doing is saying if this exists in the folder, that it'll run all this. But if it doesn't exist, which is what else means, it'll say that it can't find your account. And then, well, it's better than no. Alright, 
So now, does anywhere in this not have CLS? Yeah, right here doesn't have CLS. All right, so now save it, load it. All right, so. Wait, what? Oh, I pressed that. All right, yes, load. What is it? Why is it that syntax for that is wrong? Maybe space there. Do set percent percent A. Hmm, I'm at a loss. Oh my god, I think I know why. I don't think, to be honest, that you can have these. I remember reading, or I remember, I remember both reading somewhere because I had this problem before that these actually mean something. I don't honestly remember what they mean, but they actually mean something. And if you have those in there, it'll say that it's wrong. So actually, you know what else is not annoying me? That this doesn't have CLS. All right, so now I guess we'll save all that for. All right, so now let's make a new account. Poison. Poison. Successfully loaded. Good. Success. And then that'll just close it. Alright, guys. So we've probably been like 15 minutes, 20 minutes. Alright. Well, I hope you guys did enjoy. And if you did, please remember to leave a like, comment, maybe even subscribe. And see you guys next time. Peace.